Hello everyone, Mike Harris from Golf Monthly. You join me here at lovely West Hill Golf Club in Surrey on a very sunny afternoon. And in this video, I'm gonna be asking, should you be playing a yellow golf ball? The big thing for 2019, the big talking point is that Titleist have finally released a yellow Pro V1 and Pro V1X. And we've got different models from say all the main manufacturers, Strixon with their Z Star, uh, they do a yellow model. Uh, Callaway with the Chrome Soft, they do a yellow model as well. TaylorMade don't do their TP5 in the UK anyway in yellow, but they do do Project A, which is uh, their sort of second tier urethane ball. So these days, if you do want a yellow golf ball, but you want to play a tour golf ball, urethane covered, there are plenty of options out there. So let's get out on the golf course and see how the yellow balls perform uh, both on their own and also in comparison to standard white golf balls. Okay, so we're going to do a little bit of a live on course test here. Got a, uh, a yellow ball and a white ball. See if we can see much difference between the two when I hit drives, approaches, and also on the green as well. Going to go with, going to go traditional first. Going to go with the uh, with the white ball. Okay, pop that one up a little bit. Yeah, I got it through the um, through the blue sky fine, but when it started to drop down, uh, I felt I lost it a little bit there, going back down through the tree line. So next up, the yellow ball. Wow, I have to say that was a much better drive than the uh, first one with the white ball, but. I really found it very, very easy to track the flight of the yellow ball there. Uh, at no point when it started dipping from its peak trajectory did I lose it like I did with the white one. So that was quite interesting to see that. Um, let's see what it's like down on the fairway playing an approach shot. Okay, so I just missed the fairway with the white ball. I uh, got 180 yards. Be interesting to see this through very dappled, as you can see through very dappled light there, a lot of shadows. Uh, see how I pick up the flight of this. Yeah, pretty good actually. Um, certainly saw it come down very well, so no issues there with the uh, with the white ball, as I did have when the flight dropped uh, with the drive. So let's see how we go with the yellow ball. Okay, so 15, 20 yards further on with the yellow ball. Um, stood over it in the shadow. I actually really like uh, looking at the yellow ball at a dress. Um, don't know, it feels, don't know, possibly look a little bit bigger, a little bit more confidence inspiring. Anyway, let's see how this one goes. Oh, that's a good shot. Yeah, uh, very pleased with the outcome, uh, about pin high. But again, really found it easy to track the ball, uh, the flight of the ball there. So at the moment, yellow ball is definitely winning it for me. So here we are up at the green. Uh, white ball's just made the front edge, left myself, you know, 40 foot putt up the uh, hill. Um, one of my impressions behind the ball, well, been looking at normally a uh, white ball behind a putter head for a long time. Um, looks, it looks good as it ever did really. Uh, got a new black putter, so it's quite nice that contrast, black and white. No, I've not, I've certainly not given that enough, but um, yeah, you know, white ball behind the putter um, looks very familiar. Anyway, let's now see, hit a much better approach shot with my yellow ball. Let's see how that is. So probably a 20 footer up the, up the hill here. Yeah, I really do like it behind the, behind the ball, really nice. We are asked the Golf Monthly social media audience, so on Twitter, on Instagram, would you consider playing a yellow ball? And it was 
very interesting, across Instagram and Twitter, it was almost exactly 60% saying yes and 40% saying no. On Twitter, we had over 3,000 respondents in a 24-hour period to the poll. Very interesting to read some of the comments there about why you would or wouldn't play a yellow golf ball. I think perhaps there's been a bit of a stigma that yellow golf balls are for higher handicappers who are worried about losing golf balls or maybe for golfers who are older, whose eyesight isn't as good. So we've come down to the fourth tee here at West Hill, lovely uh, par three, quite pretty tricky. And it certainly is right into the sun, as you can sort of see when I turn this way, I've got the sun really in my face. So I'm gonna see if there's any difference between picking up the flight of the white ball or the yellow ball. Interestingly, we were just chatting uh, to a couple of golfers out here who were in asking what we were doing. We said we were doing a little yellow ball versus white ball test. And I asked one of the guys, would you ever play a yellow ball? He was a uh, a decent golfer watched him hit uh, a couple of shots I would say you know single figure golfer and he said definitely not so uh, and sort of I guess the intimation was that you know uh, yellow balls were not for better golfers but he did acknowledge that he'd seen Bubba uh, using it at the waste management the yellow pro v1 so uh, I don't know might be able to, perceptions might change uh, after a while if you see guys on tour um, using it Yeah, actually found that was a white ball. Found that pretty um, pretty easy to see. I didn't hit it, it wasn't directly into the sun. Um, right hand side of the green, I would think when we get up there. Yeah, I definitely, I definitely think the yellow ball is easier to see. I think when it goes into the sun, it almost turns black. Um, so again, it makes it a little bit easier to pick up the flight of, but two pretty deep, I'd be very happy with those shots uh, with a card in my hand. So that was a really interesting experiment, playing a uh, yellow golf ball against a white ball, seeing how it looked down at a dress uh, and also seeing the flight of it. But what do you think? Uh, let us know, put a comment below. Uh, let us know, have you played a yellow golf ball before? Would you play a yellow golf ball now? Any particular, will you be trying out Titleist's new yellow Pro V1 uh, this year? I'll pick a comment at random and I'll send you uh, a dozen yellow golf balls just so you can uh, do a bit of product validation yourself. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, if you find it useful, give us a thumbs up. Let us know what other sort of gear videos you'd like us to have a look at. Remember, do subscribe to the channel if you don't already and hit notifications so you see whenever we release one of our new gear videos. But what about the verdict? Well, as I said earlier at the start of the video, my eyesight's not as good uh, as it was when I was maybe in my sort of 20s, even with glasses on. And I have to say, I definitely find yellow golf ball easier to pick out in the flight uh, of the ball. Particularly, I found today's obviously a lovely sunny day, uh, but in flat light, I definitely find a yellow ball easier to pick out um, there when it's sort of dropping out of the sky at the top of its flight. I quite like it at a dress, you know, a lot of the modern clubs, I've got a black headed driver and also a black headed putter. I quite like that contrast between the yellow uh, and the black at a dress. Don't find it off putting at all. I know some people are not keen on the look and there are lots of different finishes um, of the different, you know, yellow book golf ball. Some are sort of more of that sort of chalky matte finish. Uh, some are really sort of bright, almost sort of pearlescent. But I definitely think that if you um, are looking for something a little bit different to help um, pick up the uh, flight of the golf ball, that a yellow golf ball is certainly worth trying. Say Bubba Watson's been trying them out on tour. I know that Bubba's quite a quirky guy, tries different things. But I'm certainly, I think, going to be playing uh, a few rounds with the yellow Titleist Pro V1X. Pro V1X is a ball that I normally use. So I'm looking forward to putting that in play this season and seeing how I go with it. But for now, from West Hill, it's goodbye.